Good evening. How are you? Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Hi, teacher. I can hear you. Very good. Welcome back. I hope you had a nice day today. Did you do anything different today? Anybody? Edward, Juan, Gabriela, Rebecca? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. <clears throat> okay, good. So welcome back, everybody. It's July 2nd, 2020. Briefly, um, what did we talk about yesterday? Which topics did we cover? Do you remember? Yes, yeah, teacher, I remember the class yesterday. Okay, can you mention one of the topics we covered? Uh, the correct use, the use to. Okay. What is the function of use to? Um, if you want to say something you do when you were a kid or a, a child, you are younger, but you don't do, and you don't do anymore in Good. the present. Okay. For example, I used to watch chapters, cartoons, but I don't do watch TV or in this moment. Okay. okay. Now that is positive in the past, negative now. Something you did in the past, but you don't do anymore. Can you do it differently? Like something you didn't do in the past, but now you do? Can you use it like that? Everybody. Yes, uh -huh. And you can say with never to, and you, I didn't used to play sports. Okay, good. Example. Right, good. You can say I didn't used to study English uh, 10 years ago, but now I do. So you can do that too, okay. Um, any questions about that topic, class? Comments? Yes, no, maybe. Can you guys hear me? Yes, sir, we can hear you. Okay. All right. But any I think. Is there uh -huh. not any question? Okay. Yeah, because your silence speaks a lot. You know, like when you stay quiet, okay, is that a yes, a no, maybe? All right, good. Okay, so let me ask you a question. Uh, what do you usually do on weekends on a regular uh, time of the year, let's say without the emergency, what do you usually do on weekends? Volunteer to answer that question. What do you usually do? Does anybody do something okay. on your weekend? Okay, teacher, in my case, I usually do, I usually clean my house. Okay. And and I do shopping. Okay. Now, do you still do shopping? Do you still clean your house? Yes. The two? Both? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Good. Because I need to, to buy food for the, for the week. Okay. Good. All right. Anybody else? Thank you, Lisa. Anybody else? I used to go to mass. You used to go where? To mass. 
touch. Okay, uh huh. And now you don't. Yes, I can. Okay, is the church near your house? A little. Okay, is it a walking distance? No, I need to go to in a car. Okay, good. All right. So very similar to the, the first two examples that we have, uh, Claudia is telling us, well, I used to go to church, but now I cannot. Um, then someone else said, well, I used to go shopping and I used to clean my house, and I still do. So I want you to make a time contrast using uh, what you used to do. Do you do it now still? and what you're planning to do this weekend, starting tomorrow, Saturday, and Sunday. So for example, I said, well, I remember Fridays was my short day. On a regular basis, Friday was my short day. But now, every day is short. I don't have much work. And tomorrow, I will still do the same. I will be in my house all day. Are the instructions clear? Class, are the instructions clear what you're supposed to do? You can repeat, please. Sure. You, you will talk about, uh, imagine that July 2020 is normal. We don't have emergency. What you usually do on weekends? Well, I usually go to the beach, I usually go dancing, I usually visit my grandparents, but now you don't and tell the person you're going to be working with what you will do this week. Okay. So let me write in the chat. What, let's see, what did you use to do? What did you use to do? Do you still do it? And what are you doing this weekend? So, do you see the three questions that I wrote for you? Okay. Okay, what did you used to do for, on a weekend? Do you still do it? And what are you going to do this week? So I will assign you to start working in pairs uh, practice your speaking, your pronunciation, your intonation. And if you have any questions, you let me know. So here okay. we go. Can you hear me, Annie? Hello, Syrah.
Good night, teacher. Hello, how are you? Fine. How are you? And you? I'm doing okay, thank God. How is everything with you guys? Uh, my day is, uh, is very good. I, I am relaxed. Okay. Are you working in this moment? Mm, no, no, no. Okay. Moment, because uh, the pandemic. Uh, uh huh. I work that in my in my home. Okay, so you're doing home office. Yes, home office. Okay, that's good. And in Saul. Hello, teacher. How are you? Fine, and you? Doing okay, thank you. Are you you're guys welcome. are you guys practicing the questions that I told you? Are you? Excuse me? Are, are you practicing the questions that I wrote in the chat? Ah. Okay. Are, are you practicing them? No yet, because I... Se lo diré en español. Okay. <laughs> no sé cómo decirle. Eh, vamos entrando. Bueno, a mí me agarra un poquito la tarde. Eh. Entonces voy entrando a la clase y no sé si ha dado instrucciones o... Yeah, uh, the teacher. Yes. Excuse me. Yes. Excuse me, teacher. Uh -huh. uh, the questions uh, are, what did you used to do? Right. So you use them past. Uh, you compare and you ask, do you still do them? That is present. And when you talk about what you're planning to do this weekend, that is future. So you're making time contrast. Past, present, and future. Okay. Do you understand the instructions? More or less. Uh, it, it, it's, it's, it's like, uh, if I ask Saira, Saira, what was a typical weekend in your life uh, last year? And she will say, well, I used to go to the beach, I used to go dancing, I used to visit my family. Now, Saul, you have to ask her, do you still do it? Most likely she will say, no, not anymore because of the emergency. And then you have to ask her what plans she has for this coming week. Uh, Is it clear? Yes, it's clear. Okay, so I will let you guys work. Is almost half of, of my time, and that's it. From work to home, uh, from home to work, and that, <laughs> and that's it. And where do you work? I work. I work in Holcim. Oh, it's great. And where do you study? Mm -hmm. Something or only? And for example, here in Metropan, we had a we had a problem because here start the quarantine in that place. Did you remember? Yes. When the president said here in Metropan, we will have a a the first case of coronavirus. Yes, I remember that. Yeah, that that day was very. Uh, this one with my with my mother, we're gonna sell pupusas. <laughs> <laughs> Delicious. <laughs> yeah, for me too. Uh, do you make pupusas, Rebecca? Yeah, I can do. Good, good. That's but good. I used to do tacos on. Sunday, on, on Saturday, sir. Okay. For, for, sale. for sale. Yeah, for sale. Okay, good, good. In Tawilapa. Uh huh, in Tawilapa. Uh, Where is Tawilapa? Uh, oh. What is a reference <laughs> point or city? Um, 
I don't know exactly, but it's it's out to the to, to the theory. Um, it's near. It's, it's nearest to Chalatenango. Okay. Uh -huh. All right. But I don't know exactly. <laughs> okay. That's all right. <laughs> It's very difficult for there. We finished, teacher. Okay, let me check in one more group and then we go back to the main session. Okay. Thank you, teacher. All right. I want to continue in my career because it's so important for me. And what is your advice for me about, the, about my career? What do you think about, about my career? And is it difficult get a job or no? Mm, no, it's not. It's not difficult get a job. Um, now is 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 an it's a career with with very very demand. Um, and the Utla University is very good. Some friends, some friends, mine. Uh, are studying here, there, sorry. <laughs> um, they they have um, a half time uh, in in the weekend, and and they and they are still working and and what's it here? They are, they are doing both things at the same time. They are studying and they are uh, working. <laughs> yeah, you because have the university, it's, it's better. Because, uh -huh, because the university is, uh, is very uh, access in, in, in this form, right? And okay. In this moment, I want, I want a concert because I have to do it and my Professional hours, uh, don't remember, is okay? Professional hours or a professional? Yeah, professional um, hours. Yeah. Okay, professional um, hours. it's a difficult because it's a great opportunity for opportunity to get a job and in this moment I can do it, my professional hours in my career. And it's so difficult to study online, but what what do you think about the the world as a technic six electric what are you doing in your job okay um i am i am an electrician of field uh sería como electricista de campo field um, electrician field electrician okay uh -huh. <laughs> and I okay, right. I have I have to my charge all plan in my turn and I I see all uh, we call CCM Central Control Motors and and I have a, correct Central Control de Motors and I have oh, I okay. have a charge I have a charge in all the machines and all the all the electrical part of the machines and and that's it and just like i go to check out that the machines are okay oh, okay i understand and mm -hmm. i had another concern because in this moment i don't do the, the practice i only study the theory and i do ah. know i do do the, the practice but do you feel no so, uh, 